a view from the truss cameras on the space station. The automated command has been issued uh, for final approach that will enable the progress to come in for its docking to the aft port of the Zvezda service module a few minutes from now. Yeah, and you, you are go to use overlay or the range ruler for size monitoring. Progress now closing in on the 100 meter mark, closing at a rate of six tenths of a meter per second. Everything continues to go as smooth as can be. Negative. And again, this view, uh, looking right down the barrel of the aft port of the Zvezda service module, the service module having been launched in July of 2000 as the uh, centerpiece of the uh, Russian segment of the International Space Station. Progress closing in uh, at the very uh, bottom of that docking uh, port is a docking target that will align uh, with the crosshairs on the Progress's external television camera. They will be brought in automatically through uh, the Corps' automated rendezvous system uh, to ensure the precise alignment for contact and capture. Range 50. Range Less than 50 meters separating progress and the aft port of the Zvezda service module closing at a rate of just under 2 meters per second. So far so good. A textbook approach by the unpiloted resupply craft. Just about 15 plus hours from now, another craft, this time the Northrop Grumman Cygnus cargo craft, the SS John Young, will be uh, arriving at the International Space Station with its load of supplies and scientific experiments to be plucked out of its orbit by Serena Onan Chancellor and Alex Gerst operating the Canadian built Canadarm2 robotic arm. And the progress uh, two days uh, from its launch back on Friday uh, U.S. time, early Saturday morning Baikonur time from uh, Gagarin's launch pad, uh, pad one at the Baikonur Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan, about uh, to reach its final destination on the aft port of the Zvezda surface module. Less than 50 meters now separating the two craft. You can see uh, that uh, the range for the overlay. docking target uh, coming into alignment uh, with the center of the crosshairs, 30 meters separating Progress and the International Space Station, closing at a rate now of about one-tenth of a meter per second. See the docking target uh, almost in perfect alignment with the Progress uh, docking probe through this cross-aired view. Inside uh, 10 meters, moving at uh, a very slow and steady rate of about a tenth of a meter per second. Progress just about there as we stand by for contact and capture of the International Space Station. Three meters. Continuing final approach. Three meters. Copy. Three meters. Almost there. 
standing by for contact. Target is in the center. Crosshairs are aligned. Contact confirmed. Capture confirmed. Docking confirmed at 10.28 p.m. Moscow time, 1.28 p.m. Central time, 2.28 p.m. Eastern time. As progress in the International Space Station flew 252 miles over Algeria. Progress's journey now complete.